time ago I had to run in use the bathroom after I just came from out over there and double check trailer truck blah 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 um, I picked up this trailer last night or I hooked up to it last night my dumbass um, looked up my paperwork and became, and did one of the students moved and put a fucking I put my dang uh, last different trailer number on my picked up trailer number so this morning done with that realized that the trailer number I put on there was the trailer number that I grabbed but yeah I got that done got this trailer on me and now let's get the heck out of here um, and go from there my plan is to make a detour, stop at the house. Yes, it's gonna be extra miles, but you know what? Shit's gotta get done, and I'm trying to get up there and take care of it, do what I can do. So, let's get out of here.
did go in there and attempt to uh, see if they had a student. Yesterday I got a phone call from a lady in Phoenix when I was picking up the load. And she asked if I was ready for a student or would like a student or blah, blah, blah. I told her, well, I'm about to take off. Unless, like, he's ready right now, right now. She goes, well, he li he's ready, but he lives in Tucson. I was like, so there'll be a couple of hours before he even gets here. Like, yeah. And I'm like, well, I'm about to take off from my pickup. So... went in there this morning, seeing if they had a student. Come on. Of course they didn't, so we're going to roll out once we get loaded. Alright, so tandems are slid. About to pull out, close the doors. This load's about 22,000, I think. If I read it right, it's not that heavy. Um, it's better than 2,000 or 12,000 with a full load. Um, go close these doors, get checked out, and get out of here. So, I'll see you guys shortly. We're at a stop on the 15th. Yeah, I'm supposed to be over there, but there was a freaking line to through to hell freaking further down. But yeah, basically sitting here at 2.50 in the afternoon. It's great. So I'm sitting here and I'm I just have the defrosters on, and I'm like, what the fuck is that smell? And I look down, and this truck is doing a regen. As you can see, that little light. That basically means exhaust extremely hot. Don't get near. But, it kind of sucks when these trucks, if you can smell that crap inside the truck, there's an issue. But... I ended up turning the psycho crap thing off because you can't have it on defrost without the AC to this truck works but it sucks on what you can and can't do but get up what's up everybody it is one o'clock uh, I just left I didn't just leave but about an hour ago I left the
We are in Nephi, Utah. Just got here. I'm stopping to take a 30 minute break. I'm right outside the truck stop. Pilot on J. It's literally right over there. And the on ramp going south is right there. And then north is up there. Came over here because, of course, there's no parking in there. And it's early. Well, I guess it's 10 o'clock. No. It's going on 9 o'clock. That place is packed. It's a trip. I can't get... I'm not, I'm not going to get anything anyway, so it doesn't matter. But we are going to be at our delivery like about 11 o'clock 11 30 the wind is a little breezy of course right now you don't hear it or feel it but it's a lot stronger than what it is right now when you're driving because you can feel it and then this truck it sucks but not a big deal um do what I did last time get up there park on the street hopefully and then get a couple hours of sleep and then have to wake up and go deliver last time I went to this place <clears throat> I got up checked in and he just had me drop it in the door and then pick up a different trailer now depending on circumstances on what this trailer is gonna look like or if they have one different story so I do got another load going to Idaho and yeah but I'll see you guys when we get to our delivery Swift trailers over there. Right over there. Hopefully this light's not fucking up or messing up the view. Right where those two trucks are. This is where I'm delivering. Last time there was a trailer there. But now there's not. So yeah. I don't know. Whoever had this truck last. They use a lot of freaking glue for everything to stick on the windows. They use glue, whatever the hell this crap is, to put whatever he had here. And then up here, they use glue to put that there. But that, I noticed, doesn't work up here at every scale or whatnot. So why would you put it there? So I moved it and put it over there. But anyways, I'm tired, mentally tired. 
and it's time to go to bed. So, as far as I know, I don't really have anything interesting to say. Nope. So, on that note, thank you for watching. Click the subscribe button, thumbs up, let me know how I'm doing, comment, do what you guys do. I'm out.